Well, you guys probably remember Lieutenant Jim Crawford with the Lexington County Sheriff's Department and Steve Dybul with the Live at 25. And we have these guys here today again to talk a little bit about distractions on the road because there's so many more distractions when you're driving now. Absolutely, Amy. You, you look at there's an average of 100 distractions in any given mile and compounded by the fact of technology, how it's advanced today, that you've got cell phones that people yeah. text on, talk on. It's, you know, it's extremely uh, distracting for the one's attention to where they should be paying attention to the road, and indeed they're not. And let's face it, there's more cars on the road today too, aren't there? Absolutely. Uh, our young drivers uh, have access to vehicles unlike any other time. They're buying newer vehicles which are faster, have more technology, GPS uh, yeah. to add to their cell phones. So uh, we just keep throwing distractions in their, in their lap and expect them to uh, be able to uh, respond appropriately and that's not happening. Of course, you know, you've always got the, not only the distractions, but buckling up your seatbelt, uh, impaired yeah. driving and speeding. Those three are also critical factors, but you, you take all of that cumulative and, and it provides a, a very deadly situation with a 4,000 pound missile and, and yeah. you're putting a child in it and expecting them to, to drive with the same finesse and prowess that someone with 20 or 30 years of experience would. Well, Brooke, can you introduce everybody to your new mascot here? This is Mardog, the Alive at 25 mascot. And over the course of the three years, we've been able to do amazing things. But we're a firm believer in all great things have a mascot. <laughs> USC, Clemson, and so if nothing else, Alive at 25 now has an official mascot. <laughs> Welcome aboard, Murdog. <laughs> well, we appreciate you letting us come, Amy. You know, this has been an exciting time of year. We've done... With the Live at 25, we're going on three years. That's just amazing to me. It's been three years already. I remember the first time we came and met and, you know, Mr. Ray got involved three mm -hmm. years ago, almost to the day. And, you know, since then, we've been able to put over 19,000 kids through this program. Wow. Well, wow. and fatalities have gone down in Lexington County since that time. In Lexington County and throughout the state of South Carolina, we've seen a huge reduction. And, you know, we also like to say it's Alive at 25. It's our law enforcement partnerships. It's, you know, amazing individuals such as Mr. Ray and Ray Mazda that have come together to change the culture in the state of South Carolina. You know, we have a goal of zero fatalities for next yes. year. Yes, yeah. Zero fatalities, which means everything we've done over the past three years is is going to have to be tripled. Yeah, and, and, and that you need that kind of support to do that. Mm -hmm. The kind of support you give to them. Well, I, you know, I, I was standing here thinking earlier as they were chatting, I hope that all the families out there in South Carolina realize this could well be the most important message, the most important thing yeah. they see. This Live at 25 program has, has been a phenomenon. I think the proof of the phenomenal work that you guys have been doing is in the numbers. You know, absolutely. Be between 2006 and 2008, we saw a 35% reduction. And I'm just absolutely wow. pleased to say yeah. that last year, we did even better. Really? We continued to decrease the amount of fatalities of the 15 to 24 year age group. Mm -hmm. And But unfortunately, our goal of zero is not accomplished because we had more than one fatality last year. Yeah. 